Namaste to everyone. I am Yogi Himanshu, founder of Himalayan Yoga Association and Bali Yoga School. And today I am gonna tell all of you about Gayatri Mantra. So I am gonna tell you about its meaning and it is very powerful mantra. So before I show you how to chant it and why to chant it devotionally, before that I want to let you know that uh, any kind of mantra, whether it is Gayatri Mantra, whether it is Om Namah Shivaya, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare, Maha Mantra. So, Mantra means set of divine words which has capacity to bring the mind into divine level. So mantra cleanse the mind. Mantra cleanse all the bad habits of the mind. So that when mind is cleansed, when mind is peaceful, only then we can understand what is behind the body and the mind. Who is that who is running this body and the mind? And why we are so happy when our mind is peaceful, when our, our body is peaceful. So, the, this is the power of the mantra. So if we chant the mantra every day and chanting not just uh, like there must be full devotion to the mantra and we can only understand the power of mantra when we chant it when we ourselves experience it. So chanting it full of devotion and full of, you know, uh, belief, only then we can experience it and it has great power. So this what mantra means. And this is the power of mantra. So now I'm gonna today tell about Gayatri Mantra. So Gayatri Mantra is Om Bhur Bhuvaswaha Tassa Vitur Vareniam Bhargo Devasya Dhimahi Dio Yona Prachodayat and its meaning it's, it has beautiful meaning and not only this mantra but I find every mantra is beautiful and powerful so its mean Om the divine light please guide our mind to the divine light so that we can experience it within. So we have divine light within. So when our mind is clear, our body is healthy, peaceful, we feel the divine awareness within and around in the world. So we can experience it within and around us to live the divine life. We can only live the divine life when our mind experiences it. 
when we taste it and uh, the whole world becomes beautiful and meaningful when we live the divine life so this is the mantra and this is its meaning now i'm gonna chant for all of you you can chant in any tune you want but uh, as per my experience i really feel too much connected when i chant this mantra in uh, ancient rhythm in ancient tune which is used to uh, lead fire ceremony yagna so i love this tune but if you uh, want to chant it in another tune that is also absolutely fine the most important thing there must be devotion there must be heart whenever you chant people say different different things but uh, i say only believe when you experience yourself if you have not experienced anything yourself then it is absolutely has no value then it is not truth for yourself the only truth when you experience it so most important chant with full of devotion so i am going to chant two times for all of you and therefore you can practice it in your home or in your practice hour so i request whoever is watching this video to pay full of respect to what we are doing sit comfortable in wherever you are join both palms together front of your chest and for just 2 or 3 second sit quietly bring your attention to your breath mouth closed breath flowing through the nostril now take deep long breath through the nostril out through the nostril be completely thankful to the universe for giving us this human life and believing in yourself that you can do anything you want to do for yourself and for helping the society now we will chant the mantra om bhur bhuva swaha tasavetur vareniya bhargo devasya dimahi dio yo na prachodaya om bhu bhuva swaha tasavitu chodaya one more time om bhu bhuva swaha tasavitu varenyam bhargo deva 
स्वादी दियो योना प्रचोदया शांति 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 फील योर ब्रेथ फील द एनर्जी वी क्रिएट आर सेल्फ्स विद इन एंड अराउंड अस द पीस once more before opening up the eyes being fully grateful to this life to all the up and downs to your family member friends people around to the divine bow down your head now before opening up the eyes you can gradually rub your palms very gradually not hurting the palms gradually and then touching your eyes your face your neck or in any other place you want to touch and transmit the energy and then by looking downward you can gradually open your eyes namaste